a designer vagina is an eye-catching marketing term for the cosmetic procedures that are performed to improve the appearance of the outer part of the female genitals. Procedures that are performed as a part of the designer vagina surgery includes vaginoplasty, labiaplasty and even clitoral hood reduction. Hello all, I am Dr. Rashish Kare, Senior Plastic Surgeon and Cosmetic Surgeon, Kalosa Aesthetics, Gurugram, New Delhi. Follow my channel Kalosa Cosmetics and my website kalosa.in and kalosaesthetics.com for more information on various cosmetic and plastic surgery procedures. Now, every woman has a unique anatomy. Some women have extra folds and for some women, one side is longer than the other. There is no such thing as normal. If you are dissatisfied with the appearance of your lady parts due to aging or childbirth, or you are experiencing physical discomforts due to excess skin folds, you may consider a procedure to improve your confidence or quality of life. My goal is always to create a result for my patient that is symmetric and aesthetically pleasing. Although there is no globalized basic guidelines for genital aesthetics, but some include firstly symmetrical labia minora that do not protrude past the labia majora, especially when standing. Second, a clitoral hood that is reasonably short and non-protumbrant without extra folds. Third, full labia majora without redundant skin but not overly fatty which can cause an unsightly bulge in the clothes. And fourth, a mons pubis that has mild fullness but does not protrude in clothes. Now what are the benefits of the designer vaginal procedures? This surgical procedure offers the following benefits. Improve aesthetics and reduce your physical discomfort. Example, pain during sex or vaginal irritation due to large vaginal folds. You experience irritation and other discomforts, especially when wearing tight fitted clothes. Increase self-esteem or self-confidence. You are not satisfied with the appearance of your intimate area and lastly, youthful appearance of the genitals. Now let me discuss what is the labiaplasty procedure, also known as labial rejuvenation. This surgical procedure is performed to reduce the size of the flaps of the skin on either side of the vaginal opening called this labia minora. By reducing these skin folds, we can eliminate pain during sexual intercourse and other physical discomforts such as vaginal irritation. This in turn allows you to perform normal day-to-day -day activities. Well, this is usually a daycare surgery and you need not stay overnight in the hospital. Or the facility. Patients can opt for local anesthesia as well as general anesthesia depending upon their pain threshold. Recovery time for a designer vaginal procedure during the first 48 to 72 hours of the recovery period you may experience some light bleeding but this is an expected clinical outcome. Healing of the surgical incision and vaginal structures usually takes four to six weeks. It is important to keep in mind that the recovery time may vary from patient to patient. Now Let's discuss some of the risks and complications of the designer vagina procedure. Like any other surgery, a designer vagina procedure also has potential risk and complications, but usually minor. It is safe surgery and this include falling, a bleeding, minimal, you don't need to worry about that, changes in the vaginal sensation, that too also transient, delayed wound healing depends upon person to person and chances of infection which can be easily managed. The way that I perform my labiaplasty procedure is tailored toward the individual patients. I like to call it designer vagina because it is precise shaping and tailoring of the vaginal area to the patient's individual concerns and what they want to look like aesthetically. I've developed a special technique that has no pain, a nearly invisible scar and natural looking results when no one can tell that surgery was ever done. I performed the labiaplasty surgery under 
3.5x microscopic examination in order to create a precise and symmetrical results as possible. The sutures that I use are extremely delicate and small so that this also helps me see every little last detail down to the millimeter. I need my patient to be completely still for the procedure. To me, even a millimeter matters. Patient privacy is another aspect we really follow and making sure that my patient is fully covered and comfortable as well as protecting their modesty which is really important in a surgery like this which is intimate and in a sensitive area. The reason I am passionate about the surgery because I feel like it makes such a big difference for a woman. It helps with patients overall quality of life whether it means that they are more comfortable wearing their clothes. They don't see an extra bulging or extra tissue when they are wearing leggings or swimwears and overall it makes them feel more confident. Well, thanks for watching this video and hope it gives some insight about this topic. Stay connected to me through my channel that is Kalosa Cosmetics or visit my website kalosa.in or kalosaaesthetics.com. Thank you.